Привет, друзья! My name is Aida and welcome to my channel Russian Easy Learning. Before we start, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. Also, you will find a lot of useful information on my website RussianEasyLearning.com. Okay, today I want to answer the most frequently asked question. How many time do I need to learn Russian? Many people have asked me this question and I decided to answer it in this video. So, to answer this question, we need to answer several sub-questions. Let's go in order. The first question is, what level do you have now? This is a very important point. You realize that if you don't even know the alphabet, it will take much longer to learn the language than if you already knew how to read. In general, the standard specifies the number of hours required to study each level. So, to achieve the A1 level, you need 100 to 120 academic hours. And to achieve the A2 level, you need 180 to 200 academic hours. It means that the student knows the language at an elementary level. To reach B1 level, having knowledge, skills and abilities at the basic level A2, you need 160 to 180 hours. If student starts from scratch, he should study 440 to 460 academic hours. The next and no less important question is, what level do you want to reach? If this is level A2 for use in everyday life, then you will need much fewer hours than for level B1. You will find a more precise number of hours in the previous answer. The next and very important question that you need to answer yourself honestly. How often do you practice? If you practice regularly at least two or three times a week, then the result will not take long time. But if you practice irregularly, it will be a very, very long story. Regularity is a very important when learning a language. It is better to practice every day for 15 minutes than once a week for two hours. The next important question is, where do you live? If you are in the country of a language you are learning, your progress will be faster. And the last point, which I also want to pay attention to, what is your native language? For example, if you are studying Russian and your native language is Bulgarian, it will be much easier for you and the learning process will take you less time. Since Bulgarian belongs to the group of Slavic languages. But if your native language is Chinese, you need to spend a little more time and efforts. Friends, the main thing I want to tell you, make language learning interesting for you. And then you will do it with pleasure. I hope that I answered the question. If you have any questions about this topic, please write in the comments. And also please write how long you have been studying Russian and where are you from. Thank you so much for your attention. See you. Пока-пока.